Welcome back everyone to a very chilly Mildura morning. Uh, in this video we're going to look at some of the murals and street art around Mildura. Uh, there's a map on the Cancel website that I'll put up in the description and um, most of these murals or street art are all within walking distance. Um, there's a couple that are at the 15th Street end of town um, but there's a lot there that are also aren't on the, the Cancel uh, map. So uh, stick around and check them out. So the first one we're looking at is on the Nash Lane building. So Nash Lane is a pretty cool little coffee shop and a, and a eatery. So we'll wander up and have a look at this one. Uh, now there's a little bit of a hidden one on the other side of the building too, which isn't a professional one, but well, semi-professional. We'll go and have a squeeze at that afterwards. And there's the semi-professional one we'll call it. We won't offend people by saying it's unprofessional, but it's, it's still pretty cool. Okay, the next one, which is Grinders Coffee Town. I reckon this was probably the original one in Mildura. A um, bit of a backstory, it's next door to the radio station. Many years ago, I used to work at the radio station and slip across here to grab me morning coffee. So she's a pretty cool one. The next one, just down the road a little bit. Promoting a little bit of Mildura's fresh citrus. Now I'm going to apologise a little bit here too, it's, it's hard to get far enough away to get the whole mural into the shot while still showing the detail. So um, if you can't see the whole mural on the screen with some of these ones coming up, I do apologise. And we'll slip down the lane towards 8th Street and uh, this old Shiller Days building. Well it's not the old Shiller Days building now, it's the new one. Um, so Shiller Days was a department store in Mildura many moons ago. I was only a young fella. Um, so this is a, a pretty snazzy little one. And over here, here's a couple of uh, that you won't find on the Cancel website. I don't mind that one. The, the numbers on that uh, temperature one really seem to be popping out of the wall. That cat's been a bit rude too. We'll cross the road and stay on this laneway because there's a pretty cool one up coming up here that um, I'm sure you'll all be amazed at. So we're still in Schiller Days Lane, just off 8th Street. Have a look at the detail on that. This this would have to be my favourite, this one. It's um, it's just an incredible amount of detail and just really envy the people that can have the ability to do this. Okay, so we'll wander down 8th Street. There's a couple on either side of Bowerings Lane that are pretty cool. Another old building of Muldura that was once uh, the Bowerings department store. My mum used to work here. Um, and a little bit of a tribute down the bottom too to Sherpig's Bread, which was a local bakery back in the day. still in Bearings Lane, um, just on the other side of 8th Street, so use the same map to get to this one. But that's a pretty snazzy one as well. Now we'll wander down the lane here because there's a couple here that aren't listed on the cancel web shot. Still pretty cool though.
you probably won't be able to see these ones on the back of the Indian takeaway place um, and I'm not about to walk in the back of their business so uh, we'll just <laughs> imagine them I suppose and uh, around, hang on what do we got here oh that's not art that's graffiti another one here that's um, not quite finished go for a wander down Pine Avenue which isn't too far away um, there's a building there next to my favorite right next door to my favorite building first choice liquor best coldest bourbon in town I think this one's actually pretty pretty new I, I don't think this one's been here for a while now there's one on either side of the building so you have to walk into the first choice liquor car park to see the next one um, Pity it's so early in the morning, they'd grab a can. And the last one we'll look at is uh, up the other end of town on 15th Street at Centro. Um, you wouldn't be walking to this one, she's a fair hike. But uh, have a look at that. The detail on this one is incredible. You'd, you'd almost think you were looking at a photo, not a painting. Well, that's about it guys um there's bound to be some that i've missed so uh if, if you know of any stick them in the comments so other people can go and see them um and thanks very much for watching and we'll catch you next time